Diamant er en piges bedste ven. Det påstod i hvert fald Sally, Marilyn Monroe, så det skal jo nok passe. Men der er faktisk nogen, som er endnu mere glade for de funklende stene end de gammeldags blondiner i sexbombeklassen. De bor hernede i 47. gade på Manhattan. Den ridende politimand er typisk New York. Men 47. gade er ikke som de andre. Diamanthandlerne er sky ortodoxe jøder, som præger gadebilledet. Men det er bag facaden, det bliver virkelig spændende. Mod sædvane fik vi lov til at filme i centrum for verdens diamanthandel, Diamanthandlernes Klub. There's a glory about it, there's a beauty, there's a magic to a diamond. It's, so, it's something that you really can't explain, except when you give to your, to your loved one, to your, to your girlfriend, your wife, to your daughter, uh, a diamond, and just light her up. And when you see that beauty and that happiness, uh, you know what it gives. Det er nu mere de økonomiske facetter af diamanthandlen, der springer i øjnene. Selvom al handel foregår diskret i Diamantklubben, er der herfra løbende forbindelse til diamanternes tre hovedsteder i Belgien, USA og Israel. Diamanter kender ingen grænser. You can carry them very easily in a little cassette paper which you've seen before, little tiny envelopes or in a diamond wallet. Diamanthandel over borgerne er forretning med stærke familietraditioner. Selvom far og søn ikke altid er enige om, hvordan tingene hænger sammen. At vurdere en diamant kræver overlang erfaring. Farve, klarhed og slibningen kan man altid diskutere. Men vægten, hvor mange karat diamanten er, det skulle da være hævet over en hver tvivl. Eller er det? Nej, der kan diskuteres meget blandt brødre. Så det er nødvendigt for Diamantklubben at have et ældre, betroet medlem, som officielt vejer. 603. 603. Thank you. My uh, decision is the uh, the right one, the official one. And is there I, a lot of arguing in this business? It's quite a lot of arguing. Certainly, when the uh, diamond uh, weight is just on the line from a certain point, then it's uh, the buyer wants always. It should be a point less, and uh, the seller naturally wants a point more. Vel er diamanteren Pies bedste ven, men vi fandt nu kun én eneste kvinde i diamanthandlernes klub. It's a man's business, and women have not been totally accepted as an equal as yet. And I don't think this industry will ever, but we are fighting for it. Bag facaden i 47. gade finder vi også en anden fascinerende verden af de allerdygtigste diamantslibere, som nogle gange tilbringer halve år med at slibe de største og dyreste af stenene til millioner af dollars. Her har man naturligvis en anden opfattelse af begrebet beskyttet værksted. Her er mesteren blandt sliberne. What does it take to become a skilled diamond cutter? You gotta have a lot of patience. You gotta have hutzpah. Because to put a stone on the wheel that's turning 2600 RPM, and the stone is worth a million dollars or more, it, you gotta have a little nerve. Some stones, when you get them too hot, they have internal stress. They explode. No reason for it, but it happens. You can't help it. 
Did you get rich yourself from cutting diamonds? You never get rich sitting at the wheel working. You get rich if you buy and have some other people working for you. Then you can make money. Hvor kunderne kommer ind fra gaden for at se på diamanter i de eksklusive forretninger, er der igen sceneskift og miljøforandring. If I'm going to buy a diamond from yeah. you, how do I know I don't get cheated? You know, you know why? We can show these people, they trust us too. You see? This oh. gentleman. Oh, it's the president. The president, but this is You've been selling uh, you see, for diamonds to the president's no, family? No, no. Not to them. The president's family, they got anniversary. They are very, they don't buy the largest one, the very dainty one, very nice, because they got special occasion anniversaries, and they are very, very happy. And then I receive a thank you note. They say me the thank you note, it adds to my life. I don't mean right though, but diamonds. Diamonds are a girl's best friend, they are. Don't kid yourself. If you think you are, you're wrong. <laughs>